Yesterday, we arrived into Mole Bowl, where we swam with the sardines. This experience really wasn't as good as we were expecting it to be, so we didn't bother making a video on it. But today, we are doing something totally different. Our day started with a one-hour private van ride to the village of the falls. This was included in our tour package. Me first. <laughs> we were driven on the back of motorbikes for about five minutes up the hill to the start of the canyoneering. After the practice jump, it was time to start climbing our way up through the rocks to reach the top of the river. Yes, are you ready? Okay, when you do the jump, don't let me have it. Ready? No. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. <Smile> first. <laughs> you ready? Oh, no, I'm in. <laughs> jump. So where is she jumping? Yeah, just jump. So just jump out. Big yeah, jump just out. Just jump out. Just jump and out. And aim. Aim, listen to me. Don't f*** you out. You need to jump out, because if you push you end up on the rocks. Just a big jump all the way out. Okay, ready? Ready? Three, big jump. Two. Not only did I land pretty bad on the backs of my legs, Amy also burst her nose open. So our tips for canyoneering are to always listen to what the instructors say and don't hold your nose. Amy. Yeah. This is soft. Smile. Swimming again. Yeah. After we had our shots on the big jumps, it was time to head into the waterfall cave.
we booked this canyoneering trip on Viator for $38 each, which included this amazing home-cooked lunch. We booked this activity as a Kawasan canyoneering trip, but unfortunately that famous location was closed by the local government for safety reasons, so we ended up at Kabutongan Falls, which was still amazing.